with, you know, a man lying and providing, right? Mm -hmm. If you're lying to me, you're insecure about something. Whether that means you're insecure about the fact that I'm going to stay or go or believe you or turn into Inspector Gadget. So, Judy, you're saying that if a man is lying to you, it's because he's insecure, correct? About something. Okay. Even <laughs> women don't allow men to be truthful to you or whatever because if i sit there and tell you that i'm non-monogamous and you don't listen and the first thing you hold on i'm talking quam i let you talk if i sit there and tell you that hey i, I am non-monogamous and i want to deal with her and her i like the threesomes or whatever and you say you know what i don't want you to do that baby i done told you what it was and you tell me not to do it that means i'm telling you i'm a vampire and you're telling me not to drink blood so that's not a, i'm not i'm not lying to you because i'm insecure i'm lying to you because that's all you will accept you will only accept if a van, if i am real enough to tell you that i am a vampire and the first thing you do is tell me not to drink blood that means that i have two choices either one leave your ass alone or two lie to you because you gave me no choice a lot of y'all women make lie to you because when they tell you the truth you don't want to hear it. it ain't the truth you want so you get upset Freak that's just my that's just my opinion now go ahead hold on what are you arguing about it then? because of the fact of the matter is that you're saying that i'm you're saying that men lie to women because they're insecure that's false if i tell you the truth and you can't handle the truth that i give you so i give you the lie that you ask for because so you're insecure because me. you're uh, respectfully so but guess what i picked you and you seem like you was over me. and you sit there and tell me and I'm Don't telling you the, the girl that and I'm telling you the truth and you can't hear the truth that I'm giving you no I'm not insecure queen you are now Women can say that they handle the truth, but really think about this. How many times do you see people come on these apps, critique women, say things about women, and you could be a woman and say things, and women will say, you're bashing us, you're abusive, you're shaming us, you're this. But it's like, no, dude, you can critique a gender and still like them. There's nothing wrong with that. Like, you can look at me and think my tattoos are trashy and still like my personality. That's fine. It's your opinion. It's called life. Um, people judge. It's okay. But with that being said, I hate the fact that men do tell women honest things and they don't listen. Do you know how many times? I've I've had homeboys and I've heard them tell these girls I'm not trying to mess with you like that or I'm not trying to be in a relationship with you like that and these girls will keep prying and prying and prying and then start crying and boohooing when they have six or seven girls but it's like you knew what it was and you want to get mad at them for that now guys I'm not condoning this I believe you know in monogamy I like stuff like that but I'm not gonna go towards the men and run towards futures Chris Browns and all that and then wonder why I'm get getting burned when I'm playing with the fire it's simple ladies Get your mind to be rewired and stop chasing that type of stuff. But with that being said, women cannot handle the truth. They cannot. I'm sorry. You cannot critique any type of woman without them getting mad or getting insulted and shaming you back. It's like, ugh. I'm not saying this is all women, but I do know a lot of women do this. There's a lot of women out here who when their partner discloses, oh, this girl liked me or oh, this girl tried to get at me, you will react and get upset and yell and scream at your partner and scold them. And you know what that does? That lets a man know, oh shit, she's emotionally out of character. She cannot handle her words and I'm not going to tell her nothing anymore. A lot of women don't like to say that piece of the story. Um, there's a lot of times where I feel like there's a lot of miscommunication with men and women and if you constantly bicker and bitch at your partner when they are telling you something that they should tell you because you're their partner um, and you scold them, why are you upset when they don't tell you things? Because I know a lot of men who are very honest, even brutally honest at that. I think it's because I'm a very honest person that that's what I get in return. People who are blunt and roast me back, I like that because it lets me know you like me and you're a real ass person. I don't want somebody who's going to come and lie to me. I've learned over time with having brothers and a dad and stuff like that, you have to put your feelings aside. Facts over feelings and I've learned that. Now I'm not saying to be that way everybody's different but you kind of have to understand it from a male's perspective like if you're constantly bitching at somebody why the fuck would i tell you anything me personally um i'm not like guys and stuff i would just tell you regardless if you get mad or not you're gonna be pissed regardless so i'm just gonna tell you you stay mad all you want but everybody's different so like i said if you give your partner a safe space to be able to open up and tell you things you won't run into this problem simple